everyone welcome back to my channel so for today's video i'm doing my makeup using my favorite products i'm not gonna be using all the products because like i just want to show you guys like my favorites so yeah i got gathered a box full of stuff and some stuff didn't fit so yeah let's get on with the video okay so my first favorite product that i've been recent this is like my recent favorite it always changes over time like when i try something new or like um i just see like products that i've had and i didn't use it in a long time and i test it out again see if i like it and then i end up loving it so for today i'm gonna show you guys what i've been using recently which is this nyx um marshmallow primer i don't know why i just love this so much compared to all my other primers it's like really like light on my skin and it literally smells amazing and it's the best primer i don't know i don't think i'm ever gonna like hate this or like stop using it because i've been using this for like a while now so yeah this primer is literally amazing i love how light it is like it feels really really light on my skin and it smells so good and i think it does a good job like it makes my makeup stay it makes my makeup stay on and it, it's not too sticky but it's okay because i like usually i feel like when it's sticky it kind of feels heavier okay after primer i'm going to be using it's like a skin tint or something like that so my favorite like i'm gonna start off with like less coverage to more full coverage i don't really use full coverage products i don't think any of my products are full coverage so like the least coverage i think is this summer fridays um sheer skin tint i really like it because it's um like really really natural and really like just like covers like very little but barely kind of feels like a layer of skin like i just like how it's like it's good as a base so i love using this and then my other like favorite product is um for like a skin product is this elf um halo glow i do have like this is my summery shade this is like my more winter shade if i were to use it but i can also mix it sometimes my last favorite face product is this ilia skin tint i do have to get a new one i think it's kind of like running out but it's the super serum skin tint spf 40 you guys can see it's like really used because i love this so much for summer and this also has a pretty good um like coverage it's not like again it's a skin tint so i don't like full coverage it's just really nice and glowy on my skin so for today i kind of want to go really like light on my makeup but i think i'm going to go in with the elf halo glow because i just, just kind of want to test these out again and see how they are but they are always my favorite i think they'll always be my favorite I'm gonna just kind of use a little bit of this color and I'm also gonna use a little bit of the other one some summer shade but it's also really good for summer like I'm gonna swatch it you guys can see how these are very different but again this is like it's kind of, it's really sheer as well and it looks really pretty on like your skin and does make you really really glowy so I'm just gonna blend this out and I'll be right back okay so yeah these make my skin really super glowy so i don't use that much but it looks really nice and covered like very little but i love that and i think it's really pretty okay so my favorite like liquid um bronzer is this one by iconic it's the first one i've ever tried and i think it's literally almost out and it's in shade caramel glow it's super super pretty i love it a lot it's like really sheer and i think it's perfect for summer i'm gonna see like swatch it a bit if there's like anything left in it can you see that it's really pretty i'm sorry i have like a thousand different swatches here for something else oh there there still is left so oh my god i'm actually gonna use a bit of this because this is really really pretty and it's really sheer so let me show you guys how sheer this is i'm gonna literally apply it with my finger I'm gonna kind of like blend it out with my fingers because it is really really sheer so you guys see that but it's super pretty honestly i think from all any product this is my favorite and it kind of leaves like a stain do you guys see that like a little bit of a stain and it looks like you have a tan and it's really pretty my favorite cream bronzer would be this one by nyx 
it's the nyx wonder stick and it comes with like a the um bronzer and then comes with like a little highlighting wand I just use a little bit it's so i love how it blends out i think it blends out really nice and okay so sometimes i like to blend it out with a beauty blender or with a brush so i'm just gonna also sometimes what i like to do is like kind of like roll this up a bit and kind of like when i want it more natural i like just use it with a brush and like get it exactly where i want it and look at that it's just so easy to blend and it's really pretty Okay, next would be blush, and my favorite blush, um, liquid blush, are these Rare Beauty ones. I do have two, and I love them so much. I think they are glowy ones, though, but they're not, like, too much, so I really like that. I don't usually like glowy um, blushes, so I've been in shade Encourage and in shade Hope. I think these are, like, popular shades. I'm not exactly sure, but I do love these a lot, and for a cream um, blush that I do really like as well, is the one in the one size i also do love the powders but I, there is a powder one i do like a little better and this is in shade um see, there's literally three shades for each one so the one i like is called thirsty and then from a powder blush that i love so much is this one by Too faced in the shade cloud crush it's such a pretty like bubblegum pink and i love it so much so I do really, really love these blushes. I'm gonna be using Hope for today. I'll show you guys how this looks. I'm gonna go very lightly on it because they are super pigmented, but they are really, really pretty. I'm gonna use this little brush and blend it out. And also blend out really easily, like look at that. And it is really pigmented. Like I wanna go in with a powdered one but i guess i'm just gonna do this first because i don't know if i'm even be able to because look how pigmented this is it's crazy next step would be is highlighter and for highlighter my favorite liquid highlighter is the rare beauty one i don't know rare beauty just has really good products i don't have a lot of their products but i do have like a few that i do love very much and i do love this um highlighter this is the first thing i got from rare beauty and I think it's so pretty. It's in shade Mesmerize. It's the most prettiest highlighter. Like, guys, look at this. I'm gonna just blend that out a bit. I think it's super pretty. It's like a champagne color. So I'm just gonna put a bit on my cheekbones. It is really pretty. Like, I don't know if you guys can see, I already have some glow from like the other products I've used. But I don't care. Glowy is really pretty. And oh my god. It's so pretty. Go back in with my powdered bronzer. I almost forgot about my favorite concealer, which is this hourglass one. I've tried out a bunch of different concealers, but honestly, this one is the best one. It's so pretty and it blends out really easily. So you guys see that really brighten my under eyes. So it is kind of like full coverage but it doesn't crease at all and i think it's so pretty i do need to get a different um powder because it doesn't really match my concealer because i do need like a lighter concealer and a lighter powder so for my favorite powder would be the charlotte tilbury one but i don't is i don't know is there a lighter shade than two medium i feel like there is there has to be right because i think this is a little bit too dark for me but I love the formula of it. I think it's really pretty and it does set my under eyes. I'm gonna show you guys what I mean by I think it's too like dark. Okay, do you guys see how like, honestly though, it kind of does match my skin tone, it just doesn't match the concealer, but it makes it so like seamless. And look how blurring that is. It's crazy. This, um, this powder is the best. Now I'm gonna go back in with my powder blush i'm gonna show you guys how pretty this blush is and how like blurring it is it's literally just like this powder that i just use it's extremely blurring and it's super pretty 
Okay, to go ahead and see this blush, also so blurring, and it's like, it's very, it's not like extremely like pigmented, it's very like buildable, and I kind of love that. I don't like when a blush is super, super pigmented, because then it gets just like too much, and like you obviously put too much on, and you don't know how to get rid of it, and it's really hard to get rid of, so I do love how this is, and I can just apply more till I feel happy with how it looks. Okay, next and final like powder like face step would be um highlighter and i'm using this um wet and wild one let me show you guys how pretty this is i literally love it so much and it's really affordable as well like look at this so pretty it's kind of like enhances like the rare beauty um highlighter that i have underneath it's so pretty now for my favorite setting spray which is this elf Stay on my micro fine setting mist. I think this keeps my makeup on so well compared to other setting sprays. This is like one of the best. And it's kind of, I love that little ball it has to shake it. And I just spray this all over my face. And I love how it sprays. I don't know if you guys saw my other video. I kind of explained how I like my setting spray to be but my setting spray is like very misty and like kind of like goes on my whole face and it's not like too like wet and it just feels too heavy this is so light and it feels so nice on my face it's so relaxing like okay since my face is all done i'm gonna move on to my next products i think i would do my mascara i'm not gonna do eyeshadow for today because I think my eyes my eyeshadow palettes that I love has been staying the same since my last video. So yeah. Okay, so my next step, I think I'm gonna be doing my eyelashes. And for eyelashes, what I love to use. So recently I have been loving brown mascara, but I am not in love with these like the formula and the way it goes on and the brushes. Like this brush is actually pretty fine. Honestly, I think from both of these, my favorite is this one but i like the color on this one more because it's more of like a chocolatey brown you guys see that but then this one looks like it's chocolatey brown but it's not it's the sky high one i don't know it's just kind of dark it's not as chocolatey as i would want it to be like i would want it to like maybe match my eyes a bit even though they are hazel but kind of i feel like it makes my eyes look really nice so yeah, but I'm still looking for a, a real true brown mascara. So if anybody knows any, comment down below and I'll get it and try it out. But my actually really favorite mascara is this one by L'Oreal. The telescopic mascara. It's so used. Do I see that? Because it's my favorite one. Oh my god. They should make it this in a true chocolate brown shade. I have the brown one. I have the really black this one, charcoal one. Is that what it's called? Not sure, but... This is my favorite mascara and always will be. Doesn't make my lashes clumpy. Um, makes them look um, dark and like coats them really well. And I think it lengthens them a bit. I don't know if it does exactly, but I have really light lashes and they really like stick to my lashes and make them look really long. And I love that. So yeah, I'm gonna put my mascara on real quick. I'll be right back. So that's my mascara. I don't put mascara on my bottom lashes cause I don't really like how it looks so much. But I sometimes do like to dye my lashes and it looks really good because then you could see like how like my length and like it looks really nice. And yeah, my lashes are really light. They're like half of them are like dark and they go like towards the like the tips. They're literally clear and see-through. So mascara really helps and also dyeing them. Okay, next step is brows. And for brows, I do have um brow pencils and i love the nyx one i think it's so good i have two shades i have in shade auburn and taupe and taupe is my shade because auburn is too light like it was way too light for me i don't know why i think i bought it by mistake probably but it's so small and it gets like really nice like hair strokes and it looks really good but i don't think i'm gonna use it today i only like fill in my eyebrows sometimes but i'm just gonna gel them today and for gel i have two favorites so first i have this nyx control freak my top one will always be my favorite then recently i've been really liking the kosas airbrow as well but i think i'm using the next one as it keeps my eyebrows in place 
and I don't like when brows feel sticky and this doesn't like do that it keeps them in place and it doesn't feel like crunchy you guys know what I mean I hate when it feels crunchy so I'm gonna do my brows and I'll be right back okay so some of my brows turned out I think it came out pretty good okay and my favorite like lip liners are the NYX ones and then four of them and then my other favorite lip liner is this one by Charlotte Tilbury it's an it's a mini one because I just like tried it out and I loved it it's in shade um lip cheat it's really really pretty I love the shade so much is that the shade lip cheat or is it the no so the shade is pillow talk 2 in medium it is such a pretty so I kind of swatched all of them they're all really pretty but I think for today I'm gonna use the NYX one in shade natural I love how it it literally stays on for so long and it's blendable but also it just stays in place and looks really pretty so i'm gonna apply this and show you guys okay my favorite um like lip products recently have been um the summer friday lip balm and they really really are moisturizing and then my other favorite products i've been using recently is the tower 28 lip jellies i think so this is a lip jelly i think this is like the milky one and i have them in two shades in shade xoxo and pistachio love these so much and then my other favorite lip product is this Ilia one. This one has always been my favorite and it'll never like not be my favorite and I've always been using this. I'll never like take a break from it. Maybe the other ones I will but I've been using all these recently and this is in shade Only You. I do have this in other two other shades but this one is my favorite. I love how glossy it is. I also love how um, moisturizing it is because it's like a lip oil as well. Yeah, it's a balmy gloss tinted lip oil. It's literally perfect. And then my other favorite lip products i obviously love lip products i have so so many my other ones are these um maracuja juicy lip um like clicker things that kind of went viral so i do have three of them this one is like a mini one i got in like a gift set and um i have them in a few shades so i have two full size ones i have this one in a shade maracuja juicy shift the one that shifts from like this really pretty blue color to pink gonna swatch it on my hands so you guys can see do you guys see that it literally turns pink and it's so pretty it smells amazing i love it then i have it in this shade i think this is oh this is america's Ju maracuja juicy lip plump in this pretty like peach shade i'm also gonna swatch this next to the other one this one's also really super pretty and glossy but the pink one's like extra glossy for some reason because i think this might be like a lip plumper more like there's more lip plump in it than like color so much but there is a pretty good nice nudish pinkish peachy it's called peachy color not exactly sure but then this one's my favorite one the mini one i would love to get a full size of this one it's the maracuja juicy lip plump and this color is so pretty it's in shade honeysuckle i love it i'm gonna swatch it as well it kind of reminds me of the um black honey by clinique but it just it's really glossy so i really love that for today i think i'm gonna use the tower 28 um lip milky gloss in shade pistachio i love these so much they're also really really glossy and pretty look at that that is super pretty I'm obsessed with it. So that's it for my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. So please leave a like and subscribe. And yeah, bye guys.